never just say, oh, we've got books, you know, and it's a quiet place to study. And we say, oh, we've got, you know, lots of great things that maybe you didn't realize we had. You put your file, um, you know, the, the design right on the SD card, mm -hmm. and you bring that over here, plug it in, and you just kind of follow the prompts right on here. Once this heats up, it just starts making the design and slowly melts this plastic filament. This is in white, if you see the white filament inside the tube. It just slowly, you know, builds this item just one layer at a time. We can kind of point you in the direction of whatever hobby or interest you might have. Um, and we've always been doing programming and lots of great stuff like that. Even at just so small, it can still put letters. I mean, those are, you know, like pencil thin letters. It can still be that accurate. It's definitely kind of new and exciting. We've had a lot of interest in it. You know, as more people come in to use it, I'm sure we're gonna learn a lot um, just from helping people. You know, kind of that idea of learning together. It's a a big collection of things online through uh, it's run through the MakerBot people uh, that kind of that build the, the 3D printers as well. It's called Thingiverse. It's just a collection of a lot of people that submit whatever they've built or whatever they've designed rather. Pop that off. quite strong. I mean, I'm sure I could break it if I yeah. went to it, but yeah, it's kind of yeah. neat. It's very cool. Yeah. We're trying to basically bring the community in with things that they might not have access to, you know, but they're interested in.